WKRG News 5. We have the latest information on a missing woman investigation out of Washington County. What police discovered today. And police are still looking into the shooting death of a Pritchard man. We spoke with neighbors today on what to do about the violence. The last few days have been fairly tranquil with seasonable temperatures. But as we make our way into Sunday, the warm air is going to be returning and we'll start to see a chance for showers on the rise. We'll have a full breakdown coming up in the forecast in just a few minutes. And two events in Mobile and Pensacola not only in Involved food, but benefited a great cause. What those two were straight ahead. From WKRG News 5, the Gulf Coast News Leader, the news starts now. Good evening, I'm Ashley Knight. Thanks for joining us. First on five, a Washington County woman from has not been seen since late last month. Today, police may have one, maybe one clue closer to finding her. News 5's Cassie Fambro was the only media on the scene and brings us this exclusive report. Good evening, Ashley. We're on scene at Gainstown Landing, where there was a report earlier today that 36-year-old Anita Bowman might have been found. In fact, authorities located her car using sonar technology in the waterway behind me. When they pinged her car with that sonar technology, they were able to go four feet down and dragged that car out of the water. Once they discovered that car, they learned that Anita Bowman was not in the vehicle. They also did not see any signs that were overtly foul play. There were no bullet holes and no blood visible within that vehicle. Now, Anita Bowman has been missing since February 26, so several days later, family and friends are anxiously holding out hope that they will find Bowman. Uh, we're still looking. Uh, we're still searching. We're going to continue to do so. But the car has been recovered. It is the uh, city cousin. <laughs> <laughs> 